Representative Duhill, talk about uh, uh, your involvement here today and what's going on and, and who you found. Well, today uh, for Motor Sports Week, um, they're also we actually have uh, NASCAR from my area uh, with a, a local business that I have. So they're down here in Harrisburg today and they're promoting uh, arthritis awareness uh, because there are so many people in the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania that do suffer with arthritis and are, are, are fighting to feel better uh, and fighting for cures to their ailments. Uh, so I have Anthony Sassini here with me of Troy Healthcare, which is a great Hazleton business that we're very proud of. Uh, and he's down here and you could tell us a little bit about Stop Pain and what those sure. products do. Well, getting tied in with uh, Peck Motorsports was a great thing for us because Todd, the driver of our 96 car, uh, suffered from arthritis and uh, was, was diagnosed as a juvenile at age 15. So with the Arthritis Foundation from a national sponsorship behind him and us being a local manufacturer in Pennsylvania, uh, national brand that is distributed throughout the country, um, it was really a good fit for us and we're able to join the force and really start to spread the awareness for not only arthritis but juvenile arthritis as well. Just give me a quick summation of, of why you uh, decided to set up your shop here in Hazleton. Well, we're originally from Berwick, Pennsylvania and uh, we started the company in 97 in Syracuse and as we outgrew the facility we were there we wanted to come back to the area and the economic development company and uh, at that time Mayor Lou Barletta was very instrumental in helping us uh, find a home there. Representative Tool, talk to us about the importance of having companies like uh, Troy Health come into the area and provide jobs. Well, such, such a, a big thing. Obviously right now jobs are at the forefront um, of everyone's mind and we have lots of good hardworking people in our district that are looking for jobs. So what we can do to support and promote uh, the good companies that build a base in our area and grow their businesses uh, and, and are hopefully going to be able to continue to grow their businesses as we improve uh, the business climate here in Pennsylvania, it, it's very important. So um, I'm very proud of this company and also Todd Pe Peck, who you'll get to talk to a little bit later, uh, his story, the fact that he you know, battled with juvenile arthritis uh, and pulled through that and is such a great success in NASCAR uh, is phenomenal. So when you see the car and you see that the Stop Pain logo, logo is on it and they're raising arthritis awareness, uh, it, it's really, it's a good thing and it's such a great uh, cohesion between the groups. This is Todd Peck from Peck Motorsports. Uh, he's a NASCAR driver uh, and I was very proud to meet him and learn about his story. Uh, as, a, as a youngster he had battled with juvenile arthritis uh, and he is such a great success and has been so successful in the work world, uh, in sports, uh, so he really is an inspiration to kids that battle with it and parents that you know are, are dealing with their children's ailments uh, and he's teamed up uh, in this great you know, great effort, collaborative effort with Troy Healthcare as well as Stop Pain uh, management products, and they're really bringing awareness uh, throughout the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania and nationally uh, about arthritis. Uh, Mr. Peck, we certainly don't expect someone to hear from someone as young as you about the problem of arthritis. We usually associate with older folks, but tell us about your experience dealing with your situation and how you come came to be involved with this company. That, the older folks in arthritis was exactly my thought when I found out, too. I was 15 years old and diagnosed with arthritis, and I thought, well, that can't be right. My grandparents have arthritis. That that something's got to be wrong. Turns out there are over 300,000 kids across the country with arthritis, and it's, it's not as nearly as uncommon as, as you think, and it was something that at that age, you know, having to, to learn what it meant to have arthritis and what, what limitations it was going to have. And, and I was stubborn enough and had a good support system that said, it doesn't need to be limiting. You know, it, it, doesn't, it doesn't have to hold you back. It doesn't, or in this case, slow me down. And so it was something that we had to grow with and, and you know, integrate into a part of my life. But uh, with help from the Arthritis Foundation and companies like Troy Healthcare Manufacturing Products like Stop Pain, it's, it's really made uh, a really good quality of life for myself and, and allowed me to pursue career opportunities that uh, I never thought would have been possible at the time. You certainly get your share of jolts and jars doing something like driving a vehicle like this in a race, I would imagine. You do. It's it's pretty rough on you. They, they put you in and sometimes you feel like they're going to need to get you out with a shoehorn. It's it's a very physical business, but it's a lot of fun and the, the adrenaline kicks in and just it's a rush and we go from there. And you haven't let your situation with your health uh, stop at that at all? No, it's it's been, there are there are moments that it, it's really trying at times and it's very difficult some days, but 
This is what we love to do, and, and there's a great support system, great people, great companies, everybody just really being a part of this. It's made it it's something that has really been good for me and, and makes me tough, and, and we'll keep going. Well, continued success, and uh, thanks a lot for talking with us. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. And we're going to be rooting for him, the greater Hazleton area, the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania, um, obviously the Hazleton area with our ties to stop pain management. Uh, we'll be looking for this great car, and we'll be rooting for him on the road. Thank you very much. Thanks a lot. Anybody from your district?